Hello friends, welcome back. This is Manish Pandey. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to remove tag from walk queue items. You will see here we have this queue items and each queue item has a tag here. If you want to remove this tag, so we can do that using one of the walk queues actions. Let me show you how to remove the tag from the queue item. So we have already designed this process in which we are getting the next item from queue and then we are checking that we have received an item or not if yes so it will go and check the application steps so that will be if the item is related to the process pre-qualification so it will directly go here so here in the data collection we'll be getting value like application step if you'll see here so one by one item will be picked like that and it will check if this item application step equal to pre-qualification or loan application or loan funding like that so if it is process pre-qualification so it will come here and complete the process mark completed and then go back to the next item so same way it will go, do one by one and then it will go back to the completed after mark completion or like before mark completion also if you want to remove the tag from there so you can do that let me show you how to do that let me add the remove tag here after mark completion so we'll take one action stage double click here select walk queue select untag items so untag item action is used to remove the tag from walk queue item now here we need to pass item id so which item id will be passing here we'll be passing here this new item id which we are getting from this get next item so we'll pass here and here in the tag we need to pass that a specific tag that you want to remove so if you have that a specific value that you want to remove from that that one you can pass that but here we are not going to pass the default or hard coded value here we are going to directly take from that a specific data value that is application step column so from that field we'll be get, taking that is coming from here so data collection dot application step so from this collection and from this field we'll be taking our that tag name and that tag name will be removing from that queue items now in the condition you can see the precondition is none it means there is no condition and post condition the item will have the item will not have the specified tag applied to it basically there is no condition applied to this it means you can remove the tag even that is logged that item is logged and also if item is not logged then also you can remove the tag so here you can see i have taken mark completed and after mark completed i am going to take this untag item so in mark completed automatically that a specific item id will be marked as a completed and that item will be released it means that item will be unlocked now let me remove this let me click ok now let me link this one here so I, after mark completed i'm going to untag that item now here in get next item i'm going to write here minus invoice star asterisk it will only take the items from queue which has not invoice it will exclude invoice tag from our items and then it will give you give us only like pre-qualification loan funding like that if if we have pending value so yes we have pending value so let me run here set next stage and now you can see here we have in the data collection we have one value and the application step equal to application processing and this is the application step that we are using to remove the tag so this value will be applied to this untag item here that tag will be removed so no need to use here plus or minus directly use the tag name in the double quotation so here we are passing a, as a text so it is taking from collection itself so no need to pass in the double quotation but if you are going to pass hard coded value you need to pass in the double quotation now click ok and now so this value is currently application processing so it will go here uh, on this part so let me okay and now it will complete that item so let me show you here so this is sdfc 12 number item 
this is logged currently and it has application processing tag now it's going to complete that item and you will see here now this item is now completed we have this tag applied so let me step again now you can see here untag item completed and now let me and now you will see here this item key this a specific tag is removed from here so by this way you can remove the tag from the existing queue items and i hope this is useful if so please like this video and please subscribe this channel if you are new to this one thank you so much for watching this video if you want to learn ui path rpa then you can visit my youtube channel youtube.com slash ui path rpa if you want to learn blue prism from udemy so i have created one course for blue prism rpa complete course on udemy so you can go there and you can purchase that course and you can get the certificate from there i will enter the the referral code and the link in the video description you can go through that i hope you like that one thank you so much for watching this video